Hi everybody out there, it's Peter back for another video. This video is for Mark, hi Mark out there. It's a continuation of the series uh, top two songs from a band's studio album. So he wants me to do Black Sabbath, he's a big fan. I am too, I love Black Sabbath. And the Aussie era though. I'm not going to include 13 because I'm assuming he meant uh, the original band with Bill Ward in it as well. So I'm just going to do the initial um, eight albums. So I'm going to, here they are, I've got the CDs here. I'm going to pick my top two songs from each of these eight albums. So here we go. Here is um, the first album, 1970. A great cover, that one. Uh, Black Sabbath. Uh, let's see. Uh, I'm going to go for, on this album, I'm going to go for... NIB is my favourite. I like NIB. always like that riff. Uh, always one of my favourites from this album. I'm going to go for those number one. And number two, I'm going to go for the title track that uh, where the, you hear the rain coming in and sets a scene. It's a really a great opening track, the Black Sabbath, the, the song Black Sabbath. So NIB, uh, number one, and Black Sabbath, number two. So that, that is the first album. So here we go to um, 1970 again, Paranoid. Another excellent album. Um, Paranoid, the song has played out a lot. War Pigs I like. I like Iron Man. I'm going to go... Uh, Electric Funeral's good. I'm going to go a bit different. I'm going to go... Um, I might go, ooh, let's see, Fairies Wear Boots is number one. I love that. And I might go War Pigs is number two. Iron Man is great, but played a lot, but it's a great song. I'll go Fairies Wear Boots one and War Pigs two, I think, yeah, for that one, for Paranoid. This is an excellent album too, Master of Reality, num 1971. This is a bit easy to do. I'll have to go. Uh, let's see, I might go. I'll have to go Children of the Grave here. That's a great, great song. Uh, stand out on the album for me. Uh, the second choice, a little bit harder. Uh, Into the Void's excellent. I might go Sweet Leaf though. I might get Children of the Grave 1, Sweet Leaf 2. You guys might have different choices. That's great. That's great. We all got different uh, picks. That is excellent. Uh, then 1972, we go to Volume 4. Um, out of the first four, probably my favourite. Um, this has got some great songs on it. Um, and it has got probably my favourite Black Sabbath song ever, which will be number one, of course, Snowblind. Number two, I like changes. Some people don't like it. I know, I realise that. Uh, but I have to go number two, Supernaut, though. So number one, Snowblind. Number two, Supernaut. Great, great song is Supernaut with that riff. There you go. That's uh, volume four. Uh, this is a good album, too. Sabbath, Bloody Sabbath. Easy decision for number one. The title track, Sabbath, Bloody Sabbath. What a cracking track. Love that. Very good, very good track. Um, number two is a bit more difficult. Um, yeah. I'll have to, I'll probably go a National Acrobat, which is pretty good song. National Acrobat as number two. We get the Sabotage, a lot of, a big fan favourite. Now, a lot of people don't like this cover. I like it. I think it's got something about it and how they're dressed and everything. Uh, from 19... Uh, sorry, Sabbath, bloody Sabbath, 73. This is 75, Sabotage. Uh, this is a bit of a, this, a hard one to do. I'm going to go... A Symptom of the Universe is great. Um, I'm going to go Megalomania. I love that. love that song, Megalomania. Great song, great. Uh, nine minutes, stretched out a bit, really great. And I'm not going to go Symptom of the Universe, so I like it a lot. I'm going to go Hole in the Sky, a great opening track. 
So Megalomania and Hole in the Sky. These two are good albums too. Oh, they get a bit of crap, but they're good albums from 1976, Technical Exit. This is this album, I really like this a lot. I mean, um, I played it a while back and I thought, geez, it's not as bad as everyone says. I mean, geez, uh, it's excellent. It's a bit more of the hard rock. I, I guess I like it because although I like metal, I'm more of a hard rock guy. Yeah, ACDCs and Kiss and so on. That's probably why I like it. It's got a bit more of a hard rock feel than a metal feel. But um, great, great album. Uh, let's see. Oh, I can't go past them. I'm going to go... Geez, this is hard because I do like quite a bit on here. Um, you Won't Forget Me is good. I'm going to go um, Gypsy. I really like Gypsy. Um Great, great song. And It's All Right, the Bill Ward, um, which is very good. Bit Beatle, Beatle, Beatles feel to it. So Gypsy and It's All Right. Okay. That, you, that song, You Won't Forget Me, is an excellent song. Uh, the last album, I Never Say Die, from 1978. Um, let's see what, what we have here. I'll have to go, um, is it uh, Hard Road? Yeah, I'll have to go Hard Road. And um, what's the other one? I'll, Johnny Blade, yeah. Hard Road and Johnny Blade. Hard Road 1, Johnny Blade 2. So that's what I'll go for that one. They're both excellent songs, but um, this, is, this has got some good songs on it. Um, I don't think it's their best album, but it's got some a couple of good songs. There you have it, Mark. Hope you enjoyed that, and everyone else, co comment down below, subscribe, all those things. Hope to see you guys very soon for another video. Won't be too far away. Bye for now.